What's up guys, it's Nelson here from Jolly Roger Airsoft and today we're going to be taking a look at the Condor MCR 4 Ops chest rig. I personally love this chest rig because it's simple, easy to adjust, and it gives you a versatile molly platform for all your pouches. Ooh, that's a mouthful. Its price is also a major plus, as in most colors it comes under $25, which makes it a very affordable molly rig. Now it doesn't come with any built-in pouches, so you're going to have to buy those, but all in all, it's a very cheap and practical Molly setup. So, the MCR4 is pretty simple. Uh, you have a panel of 14 by 4 Molly. There's 14 rows of Molly, 4 high, and it sits across your chest like so. Uh, there are three straps that secure it. You have two straps here that go in an X in the back, connecting to the opposite side on a swivel mount. And then you have a third strap running along the waist to secure the back. So, these straps are all easy to adjust, you know, make them shorter to tighten, looser to uh, elongate. Now this can really hold a wide range of body shapes. This is fitting very tight on me, and I can get it down there, and I'm a pretty skinny guy. Um, but there's a lot of excess straps, so bigger people will be able to fit into this, and that's one of the uh, big pluses about this rig. Now, um, there is a lot of excess strap, especially if you're a smaller person but you can uh, take care of that, bundle it up, cut it off, whatever you want to do, doesn't really matter. Now, there's also molly webbing running along these shoulder pads. This is good for an extra pistol magazine pouch like I used, or to clip your radios in, or whatever other kind of clip things you might want. Uh, it gives you just a little bit more options with the shoulder pads. Here on the top, on both sides, there are small rings that are used to tie in things to your rig, like your radio, if you have a, uh, if you have a safety strap. You can tie it into the uh, loop here so that it doesn't, you know, you don't lose it out in the field. Uh, there are no built-in magazine pouches, as I mentioned before, so you need to buy your own. Um, but this also means that you can customize it to make whatever kind of loadout you want. I use triple AK magazine pouches uh, along the front just to hold the most amount of ammo, but you can really hold whatever kind of ammo you want, and that's the beauty of this rig. It's a very versatile blank slate of molly that can put whatever you want on it. The material and build quality of the, uh, this vest is pretty durable. You know, it's strong, it'll hold up to your basic airsoft use. No, it's not the best stuff top of the line, it is the Condor version, but the stitching is all in order. There's nothing too funky or crazy about it, uh, and it should last you for a good long time, and it's a good investment for the price because it's so cheap. Now, uh, it's going to hold its own, and I think it's a pretty good investment. You can get the MCR for an OD green, tan, ACU, or black for $25. And you can also get an ATAX and multicam version for around $40. Now that's available in such places as Evike and Airsoft GI and your other major retailers will probably carry it. Um, and I highly recommend it to anyone who is looking for a, a lightweight, low profile rig that's not too much of a hassle and gives you a lot of flexibility. And uh, you know, it's really just a blank slate of molly and that's the beauty of it. Simple, cheap, effective, lightweight, all that good stuff. So, uh, with that being said, thanks for watching. I do appreciate it. If you have any comments, questions, concerns, uh, feel free to comment and I will answer them as best I can. Drop us a like and uh, subscribe to see more. Thanks for watching. Peace out.